Good morning, my dear friend. I hope you're well this fine Wednesday morning. We're looking at Isaiah 58. We're at the end of verse 3, but we'll go back to verse 1 for context. It says, Cry aloud, do not hold back. Lift up your voice like a trumpet. Declare to my people their transgression, to the house of Jacob their sins. Yet they seek me daily and delight to know my ways, as if... They were a nation that did righteousness and did not forsake the judgment of their God. They ask of me righteous judgments. They delight to draw near to God. Why have we fasted and you, didn't, and you see it not? Why have we humbled ourselves and you take no knowledge of it? Behold the day of your fast. Behold, in the day of your fast, you seek your own pleasure and oppress all your workers. And the phrase, that last phrase for today, oppress all of your workers. We know the children of Israel were living in sin and the Lord was trying to deal with them. He said, yes, you seek me, you long after me, but there's sin and transgression in your hearts. What is on the inside is eventually revealed on the outside. He says, because at the end of verse three, he says, you seek your own pleasure and you oppress your workers. Eventually, the sin inside does come out. It's true, we want to treat others well. We don't want to oppress them. But the Lord must deal with the deep issues of our heart first. So what's on the inside can come out on the outside in a positive way. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we come to you today. And Lord, we don't want to oppress those around us. We want to have a love for you and a love for those around us. We thank you and praise you in Jesus' name. Amen.